Welcome to Education Lifeline. Today, we will be solving equations with variables on both sides. Now, if you haven't watched our previous video called Solving Equations Intro, it will be linked in the description below as well as on the top right hand corner of your screen. Please go check that video out before watching this one. So, when solving equations with variables on both sides, there are multiple methods you can use. In this video, we'll show you two of the various ways you can solve these types of equations. The example we'll be using is 11z plus 18 equals 3z minus 14. So we can start solving this in multiple ways. We could subtract 11z, we could subtract 18, we could subtract 3z, or we could add 14. And we can choose the method we start off with. So let's start by subtracting 3z from both sides. So when we subtract 3z from both sides of the equation, we'll get 11z minus 3z, which is 8z plus 18 on the left-hand side, and negative 14 on the right-hand side. Now we can subtract 18 from both sides to get 8z equals negative 14 minus 18, which is negative 32. Now, all we have to do is divide both sides by 8 to get our final answer. So once you divide both sides by 8, you get z equals negative 32 divided by 8, which is negative 4. And that's our final answer. We could also start the equation by adding 14. So let's see what happens when we start off by adding 14. Once we add 14 to both sides, we will get 11z plus 18 plus 14, which is 32, on the left-hand side, and 3z on the right-hand side. Now we'll have to subtract 11z from both sides to get 32 on the left hand side and 3z minus 11z which is negative 8z. Now we can divide by negative 8 on both sides to get our final answer. Once we divide by negative 8 we'll get 32 divided by negative 8, which is negative 4 on the left-hand side, and z on the right-hand side. See, notice how we got the same answers regardless of the way we used. So please like this video and subscribe to Education Lifeline. Be sure to watch our previous video and check the description below for other helpful resources. Thanks for watching.